welcome or welcome back to Budgets and Dreams. My name's Jen and I'm on a journey to pay off an absolute boatload of debt, but we are very nearly there. Um, I hope you have all had an amazing week. I am looking out of a window right now and it is drizzling, which is very sad because it's been super sunny the past few days. Um, so I hope you've been having some lovely weather where you are. Um, we're going to have another quick video today. I'm not going to do the iPad stuff, um, but First of all, before I get carried away with myself, let's jump in to this week's affirmation. So quick reminder of last week, no matter what happens, I have the power within me to overcome it. And I need to remind myself of that right at this exact moment. <laughs> uh, so this week's affirmation, I can create my own happiness oh, and don't need external validation. What a great one. Yes, I love that. I can create my own happiness and don't need external validation. That's so good. Um, so I never really caught you up on the, the CBT that I was having for social anxiety, but one of the things that came up in there was to do with my sort of perfectionism and things and people pleasing. And uh, the therapist said something which was fab, which has really stuck with me, which is there's no point worrying about things or craving things that are outside of your control. And getting external validation is 100% outside of your control so if you can give yourself that validation that you need and be your own champion and your own coach and your own cheerleader you're going to get a lot more out of life than waiting for other people to give that to you so this is fantastic i love it i really really love it cool well that's that order of business done so uh, just a quick um talk through some things um budget was all great last week uh, we came in over budget by 23 pounds and something and that was due to a bit of extra groceries and some parking um and then this week with everything going in and out our ending balance should be around two pound 30 <laughs> so our bank balance is going to be two pound 30 bit scary but it's fine that's the whole point isn't it so we try and get as close to a zero based budget as we can but it's over like a really weird way it's not every week or every month because my husband gets paid four weekly and I get paid monthly so it's a bit complicated but anyway we're at that point where we're nearly at the zero uh, again so yeah two pound thirty um digital things I put 90 quid into groceries on Hyperjar and another five into Italy my sister also put in 10 pounds over the course of the last week so we're now on 765 pounds in Italy which is crazy so we'll update the tracker in a bit and the other thing that I need to say is we had enough money in the budget for me to transfer £250 digitally to the debt. That's a whole freedom straight to the debt, <laughs> although we didn't put it in freedom. So yeah, so the debt update at the end of the month, we all get to colour that in as well, which is super exciting. So onto the cash for this week. We have got 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 52, 50 which is good. I'm very happy with that. Um, I got a bit extra in my salary this month. Um, have the tax codes changed or national insurance or something? Um, but that was good news. Right, I'm just fiddling with my phone so that I can see what I need to stuff. So we're going to start with this binder, which is like our family sort of general expenses binder. So first of all, then, budgeted spends has changed in by the sounds of it sure does so let's deal with that first so we have got one pound for cheeky bonus which is lush and then some change oh so i'll take those two and put them in floss and i'll give all that to ben um i did have to take some money out of floss this week so the money that i save in floss i don't actually have any goals for it it's just had a random two pound fifty every week so i just shove it in floss um but i bought my hairdresser um some flowers and some chocolate uh, when I saw her so I just put that on the card and then you know took the money out of floss so um yeah floss did get used this week dear little flossy uh right so we are putting 10 pounds into budgeted spend so we now have 15 in there uh family fun this week is getting five pounds uh so what I'm going to do I'm going to put that 15 back and just take a 20 and Time First is also getting £5. We haven't been able to stuff this for a couple of weeks, so that's good news. So again, I'm going to put that £15 back and take that £20. So we've got £50 in time for us. That's loads, actually. We should probably go and spend some of that, thinking about it. Uh, fuel is getting £40. But I have had um, the credit card statement, and so I need to take out £200 of this to put into the credit card pouch. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 
60, 82. So we've got 40 quid left and that's what we've just put in. Haven't actually got the credit card pouch, but that will go in there. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll pop that to the side. Um, Huel is getting 10 pounds. And again, we'll do a bit of swappage. So I'll put that 10 back and put this 20 in. So we've got 50 in there now. Probably didn't need to do that, actually. I'm just looking at all these little notes now and thinking uh, I've done myself, done myself dirty, <laughs> but never mind. Uh, dentist, that is still in there. I think I'm going to take that to the bank tomorrow. Um, car, we now do on a tracker, but in the bank we have 200 and help to buy. There's 150 in those accounts and nothing to update there. So next then into Oscar's binder. Not much going on in this one, I don't think. O stuff's getting five which is good because he has a um, hair, he needs to go get a haircut today. So what I'm going to do, actually, I'm going to take that five out and put that 10 in, but I'm going to get a really gross one so that they can take it to the barber. <laughs> so there you go. So 30 quid uh, in O stuff now. O clubs. Um, he did. So last week I said I've normally had the bill by now. I literally got the email as I got off the phone. <laughs> so £100 has gone for his gymnastics clubs and uh, we're not putting anything in here but there is 60 quid left so that'll cover his scouts and be a bit left over which is good news um school is getting stuff this week i think yeah school's getting a fiver oh that's horrid let's put this nice fresh one in here so we've got 120 40 45 so that 100 is in the bank um hopefully earning me a little bit of interest right school holidays let's tidy up so we have got five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten pounds left in school holidays, and it is finished. So we'll take those five for cheeky bonus. Why not? And this five, I need to decide whether to put it into freedom or top up. Um, you know, the upcoming holiday one. Um, so I'm just going to stick that at the back for now because I'm I'm not entirely sure which way I want to go with that. Uh, back to school is getting money. Are you? Yeah, back to school is getting a fiver. And we will just stick a fiver in there. So we've got 20, 30, 35, 40, 45 in back to school. Lushes. So that's Oscar's binder all done. So now we'll go on to my binder slash all the fun, exciting things binder. <laughs> uh, right, so hair is completely empty. We need to put £30 in there. 10, 20, 30. Um, I will put in some pictures of my hair now, actually, whilst I'm faffing about with this. So the starting point was the pink. Then we went to the interim, which was trying to get rid of a pink and some of those other sort of colours that I'd had on the roots over time. And then where we are now is this. So we are so close to getting to the blonderer. I don't know if you remember me saying that. Um, but yeah, we're very close for me being completely blonde now, which is very exciting. There's just a few bits of really, really stubborn red um, that was frustrating my hairdresser no end. So the reason I bought her flowers and chocolate, by the way, is that she's just been having a bit of a rough ride at the moment um, and she needed cheering up. But also, oh my gosh, the amount of work that she did on my hair, uh, not yesterday, on Wednesday, was just unreal. She didn't stop moving, like, painting my hair for a solid two and a half hours she was having to like go over it and do like just the general foils and then in betweeny bits and then it wasn't lifting the way that she was hoping so she had to go over it again and nothing to do with her skill it's just my hair I don't know what's wrong with it at the minute it's just being a pain um so yeah so I just got her some flowers and some chocolate because I just felt like she needed it <laughs> um bless her uh right so laptop we're not doing anything piggy saver this is for the May holidays and we're not doing anything in there. So there's 10, 20, 30, 40 in there. Birthday, that's all done. That's my niece's birthday. My birthday, are we doing anything in my birthday? Oh, we are. So I'm getting five pounds for my birthday this week. So where's my pink pen? There it is. There we go. Those are the same color. I think when that dries off, that will be the same color. Well, I'm hoping it will be the same color. Uh, so there's 10 pounds in there. Probably had a sneaky peek. Um, I did change Oscar's birthday tracker <laughs> from the very interesting blue that I added last week to this lovely bright yellow. It's super cheery, I love it. Um, but he isn't getting anything in there this week. Father's Day is getting five pounds. So there's 15 in there now. And where's my orange pen? So two more of these. Like that, lovely. 
So yeah, 15 and Father's Day, all good. And then Karalama is also getting a five, I believe, yeah. So we've got uh, 20 in Karalama now. And I need my other blue pen. No, that is so not the right blue. <laughs> we'll leave it like that for now and I will fix that another time. <laughs> um, but yeah, so there's 20 pounds in Karalama. Where's my nice blue then? Oh, it's not blue, is it? It's like a purpley. Yeah, okay, sorted. <laughs> so Italy then. So we need to cross off 15 pounds on here which is Lush. So we've got 750 already saved and then the extra 15 for 765. And then Monopoly, we're not gonna be doing that this week um, because we didn't have any money to stretch that far, but that's okay. There's no plans for the Monopoly money at the moment. We're kind of leaving it like, if we need it uh, to help pay off the debt, then we will use it. If not, we'll just have it floating. And I haven't really finalized what we're gonna be doing with the budget once the debt's been paid. Um, I have ideas, but yeah, I'm, I'm not committed to anything yet. So for freedom then, we have got 20 and I will put this extra five in. So we've got 25 for freedom. So we'll pop 10 in there. And I don't think, I could just put that straight in the 15, couldn't I? Yeah, I'm just gonna pop that straight in that 15 there. The nice one at the front. There we go. Lovely. Uh, right, so we have got money left over. £2.50 is to go into Flossie. And then £6 for cheeky bonus. So let's grab the tray. And the book. Binder, book. Book binder, binder book. Whatever it's called. <laughs> so let's roll the dice. So yeah, £6. So let's get rolling. So a six is gifts. Oh, that was already undone. One is Oscar. Bless him. <laughs> um, he wanted to get some stuff from the shop and uh, we only took a five pound note and he picked up one thing, then picked up another thing. We were panicking he wasn't gonna have enough money. Um, and then we're in, uh, I don't know how to explain it. I've not got good words at the moment. Um, we just started giggling about the fact that in the end they added up, uh, they ended up adding up to exactly five pounds and he couldn't believe his luck. <laughs> he felt like, the universe was smiling on him. It was very sweet. Uh, so that was one for me and one for debt. Oh dear me, another one for Oscar. So last one is for the, no, nope, for charity. Awesome, there we go. So quick roundup then, what have we got? We have got three in Oscar, six in Ben, two for me, three for debt, 17 for charity and two for gifts. And that is it. That is everything for this week. I can't remember what the date is, but I think I need to give you a debt update next week. I don't need to give you a debt update. I would like to give you a debt update uh, next week, I think is the plan for that. Um, but yeah, so a quick reminder of this week's affirmation. I can create my own happiness and don't need external validation. Fact, fact, facty, fact, fact. <laughs> Um, I hope you have an amazing weekend and week and I will see you next week for another cash stuff in. <laughs> Take care everyone. Bye.